Bangladesh is one of the most risk-prone countries to climate change with cyclones, flooding, salt water intrusion and river erosion that is expected to increase in frequency and severity over the coming decades. People living in the southern coastal belt and northwest flooding zones of Bangladesh are particularly vulnerable due to high poverty rates and frequent natural disasters. These areas suffered extensively during Cyclone Siddha in 2007, Cyclone Isla in 2009 and the floods of 2004 and 2007 which caused billions of dollars in damage, displaced millions and created long-term food insecurity due to breached embankments and loss of household assets. Climate change affects everyone, but it specially burdens the poor, who are the hardest hit. Potuakali, one of the southern districts of Bangladesh. The area of the district is composed of some small chores or islands. This coastal district is vulnerable to climate change as well as natural disasters. Agricultural production is very limited due to saline water. Having been close to the sea, the region frequently falls victim to frequent natural disasters. These circumstances led to enhancing resilience to disasters and the effects of climate change project to come to light. The Enhancing Resilience ER program engages and involves ultra-poor and rural women and men in the planning and building of community assets such as embankments come roads and canals and provides training in disaster risk reduction and climate change adaptation. This assists in increasing community and household resilience to disasters and strengthens agricultural production. These community people are working hand in hand to build an embankment along the coastal line. This embankment is being built to protect the local people from the high tide, flood and cyclone in order to save their cultivable land from saline water and their homesteads from high tide of flood and cyclone. Participants are involved over the course of a two years period with food and cash for work to build community assets during the dry season and food and cash for training during the rainy season when work becomes difficult. The ER program is a part of the WFP country program from 2012 to 2016. Wages are paid in food and cash where WFP provides food and the government through the local government engineering department LGED provides the equivalent in cash. Self-employment can play an important role in sustaining the gains made at household levels.
The main objective of the program is to enhance the resilience of vulnerable communities and households to natural disasters and the effects of climate change. Agar the lawn paniya sa idon fossil da khub khara boi to. Aar ei banda hawa ne dar amar dar ei khal khanon hawa ne ba ei gulo idon dar amar han bisti pani amar dar ischema to naat kai rekya. Amar dar en fossil da khub bhalo unna do korte pari. Dar ei aage amar dar dar se dhano ei to kani jomi ne ne tiris mon solis mon urde. Aar ekhon bortomane ei ban ban hawa ne bibin no rokom er ei injur sahaje amar dhan ekshomon pai. Amar ei pani theke udhar pabo. तार जो नहीं है ये रास्ता देवा ये बात देवा कारण है आमादेर शोभजी लगाते पत्ती सी हमरा पानी भी तो रे डुकते से ना तार पर पुकूरे मास्स शक कोते से देवा से बात में के ले पुकूर तलाई है मास गुलो बेर होए जाए शे गुलो थे के हमरा उद्धार पाती ज़ोलोस चार से थे के हमरा उद्धार पासी जब भी � in which they undertake about 200 days of food and cash for work. On a monthly basis, each participant earns an average of 46 kilograms of food and 1,160 taka. Taka diye mune karo nama shami ye ai ate re ai rok shugu ige se. Are daktar rodhe ham. Tiki se kono mahar. And 12 months of food and cash for training of 15 hours of sessions per month. Peer tik shabta ai ui diyor baile toli. Hain is ai training de tam. Maashe saad de training ama go. Tien mesh training de tam oi zhe gaze ye amra. Kushiyar! Participants attend a series of trainings on disaster risk reduction planning, climate change adaptation and survival during crisis, as well as marketable post-disaster skills such as income generating activities. This training also focuses on life skills such as nutrition hygiene and health. For the training component, participants receive 22.5 kilograms of rice and 652 taka in cash per month. Cash grants for investment in income generation activities will be made available to people who have worked under the ER program, especially to women. महिला रखें तो आज के ये रास्ता काटते से रास्ता बंद से खाल काटते से जार कारण है तादेव किंतु एक बात तीन क्या मौत से एवं पाशा वर्षी तारा किंतु देखा कैसे कि जे छोए मास तारा ये काज कर काजे थाके एवं छोए मास तारा ये दर के पोषिक खुन दाए पोषिक खुन निया तारा बारिते बोशियों किंतु ये तारा बारती अमरा कमिटी करार पड़े, बारी-बारी की नारी देर के कास करार तो नुश्शे ही तो करते, वों तादें नाम नहीं आ रहे हैं अमरा इखने, वों तारा माठे पुरुष शत ऐका देर तो भावे कास करते, एवं तारा पुरुष शमोमन मजूरी तारा पाई थी। Seventy five percent महिला के सिलेक्शन कोर आमदर एक कोर मुश्शे जिस जन्नो मैंडेटरी बाध्यतम एवं अनेक यूजर कमिटी सभापति सभापति सभा सभापति मैंडेटरी उमेन होता होगा एवं अनेक यूजर कमिटी सभापति हो आमदर महिला रहें सम। The local government engineering department is a strong partner, providing technical and implementation assistance in the selection, construction, and maintenance of infrastructure projects. A group of community people from the area, including government officials, community members. Both male and female and NGO staff undertake a review of the needs in the community, focusing on disaster risk reduction and climate change adaptation infrastructure. In the first time, we have to map the map and we map the map. We have to map the map and we have to map the map. We have to map the map and we have to map the map. We have to map the map and we have to map the map. We have to map the map and we have to map the map. We have to map the map. अमर मार्किंग करते हैं करार पड़े जेटे मरी नंबर बेशी होते हैं तो इस जुकी पुन्नो काज गुला आगे कोट आगे नहीं सीमा। WFP works with local stakeholders, particularly local government agencies, community-based and non-government organisations, 
and Union and Upazila Disaster Management Committees in order to strengthen joint preparedness and response capabilities to natural disasters and climate change adaptation. Kolapara Upazila the Muslim aid, many one group of people have been doing this. Among them, ER protocol is one of them. ER protocol is made up. 2500 जोन बेनिफिशियरी और था महिला उपकार भोगी के बोर्ड ग्रांट एवं नगद अर्थो सहायता दिए जाओ होते हैं विभिन्न पुरकल पर मध्य में जमान बेरी बाद निर्माण खाल खनन ऐसा मस्तों का मुस्लिम एक वास्तवन करते हैं एवं आमी निजे हो पने अनेक गुलो पुरकल पो शहर जमीने पुरी दर्शन करती हैं एवं � अभूत कारण शवा करे ये प्रोकोल पर संपर्क के संस्लिष्ट शकल की अर्थात उपजला डिजास्टर मैनेजमेंट कमिटी के अमर अभूत कोरी शेखन थे के शकलेर मने परामोशो एवं माता मदर वित्तीते कुथाए कौन एरिया थे प्रोकोल पर दिले भालो हबे शिवाबे अमरा शकलेर परामोशर वित्तीते अमरा प्रोकोल पर बसाई कोरे था कि तार पर प्रोकोल पर संपर्क की तो विभिन्न विषय तारा चिन्नित करें उपजला कमिटी का भी तो करें बंगो उपजला कमिटी शकल समस्या समाधान निश्चित करें। Through the ER program, Muslim Aid, as a cooperating partner in 2013 and 2014, assisted about 150 communities in Potuakali, Bhola, and Bagirhat. This was achieved through the construction of over 125 kilometers of embankment scum roads, 44 kilometers of road, 19 water reservoirs, 49 kilometers of digging, drainage and irrigation canals. The project handed over cash and food to 15,000 participants against employment and training, which ensured regular income health and nutrition to them and their family members. Cash and food wages reduce food insecurity during lean seasons. Community assets provide protection from disasters and enable the rehabilitation of agricultural land, thus enabling greater food production and wage labour opportunities. And the most significant achievement of this project is 72% of workers and trainees are women. <laughs>